It's Friday. Just got off of work and uh, I'm gonna go diving with my brother and his friend Randy. I never met him, but I'm sure he's gonna be a friend of mine if he's a friend of my brother. I'm just uh, happy to go cool off and swim around. Hopefully we get some lobster. Captain's on the boat. Captain Randy. Yeah, man. Bringing me along, man. I am blessed. Got good people down here, so hey, come along. Yeah. I went yesterday and the day before, so. I know, I heard I'm, you've been I'm, doing I'm good. slow, you guys are going. All right. <laughs> we need the 18 today. <laughs> This is why I live here and will stay broke my whole life. And so after work, I can go do stuff like this. All right, we ready? Let's go. Let's do it. You want me to kick, kick you off yeah, a little bit? Just a little bit, yep. All right. Here we go. Heck yeah. We're just, drop the anchor. We don't know what's down there. About to find out. Bring you guys along. The weather was beautiful when we first got out there. Just a couple rain squalls in the distance. As Soon as we jumped in, my brother just dropped the bag and we we're swimming around, trying to get our bearings, checking the area out. Just a matter of a couple minutes, he calls me over saying he sees a nice lobster. He goes down and catches them, and if you listen closely, you can hear a, a weird noise, like metal clinking around. We noticed the boat was blowing away from us fast, so my brother and I swam back to the boat as fast as we can, and thank God we were able to catch it. Anchor got fouled up, blowing away from us. But we got one lobster already. The wind picked up a little bit. A lot. Yeah. As soon as we get on the water, we start blowing 15, 20 rainbows. When we got back on the boat, we straightened the anchor out and put bigger zip ties on the anchor so hopefully it won't break again. So we get all set back up and I jumped back in the water for our second dive. We realized we left our lobster bag, so we tried to go back to where we thought we were. We hadn't found our bag yet, but Randy had a spare one. So we started catching lobster and putting it in his bag. I 
Good thing we came back to where we thought we had lost our bag, because we really started getting on the lobster. And they were all real big ones. You can see the giant one right behind him as he catches this one. As I'm filming Randy, my brother goes down and catches the other monster right next to this one. As soon as we really start getting on the lobster, filling up Randy's bag, I look over and there's the FWC coming right up on us. Yes, three divers, sir. Well, you almost got a bucket already, Randy. Woo. I told you. Good job. Down there. It's a beautiful day. I'm getting boarded right now, but we have just about everything. Man, look at that. Well, we got a warning for out-of-date fire extinguisher. <laughs> no, flares. Oh, flares. Out-of-date flares. Just out-of-date. So, they were really nice. Really cool. Um, it's starting to get late. Sun's starting to go down. Well, I guess it's just behind clouds. But we might jump in and try to get a couple more. Either way, we got a couple. Let's try it. Let's try it. We're going to try it one more time. <laughs> so as soon as we jumped in the water for our third dive, Randy pops up and says he found the lobster bag. So that was a bonus right away. I seen a nice lobster and I asked my brother if he didn't mind filming me trying to catch one. The last time we went out, I just filmed the whole time, so I'm a little rusty. If you're smart, unlike me, you'd be wearing gloves. I just didn't have any that day and it wasn't gonna stop me from trying to catch a lobster. That's a nice one there, who's big? This was really cool. I saw just the whip sticking through this grass. I told Randy, I didn't know if it was going to be a big one or not. He went down, and while he was catching this lobster, a giant bait ball came. I've never witnessed anything like this. As fast as the bait showed up, it left. I tried swimming down to get a shot from below them, but it was too late, they were gone. Catching lobster out of these little holes is definitely one of my favorite things to do. Oh, yeah. He's nice. 
Job, man. It's hard to tell on the camera, but on this day we had a full moon and king tides down here in the Florida Keys. So the current was running extremely hard. It made it really difficult to drag our lobster bag around with us. So we just left it on the bottom and started swimming around, catching lobster, and then taking it back to the bag later on. At this point, my brother has two lobsters in his hand Randy's got a lobster. I see another one, so I ask him if I can use his net, and he filmed for me. starting to get hard to see. I am exhausted. I worked all day and I sweated a lot and my toes are cramping up. Look at that. I don't think that's normal. That's what my legs feel like. I mean, seriously. That's pretty painful. But it was worth it to get some lobsters. Look at this guy. I mean, beautiful. Hey, you wanna, After you wanna we... go check right over here real quick before we go with the Shit. collar? Yeah, sure what? let's go. I got one more, but yes. can't huge, but. That's a keeper? Here's a keeper. That's it. Where at, where at? Where at? Uh, yeah, no. Not bad as is after we got boarded. Uh, you know, we burned at least 30 minutes of our daylight. Huh? I think we got a lot. I'm not sure how many we got. Yeah, we just picked up another six or seven right there. Oh, eight. yeah? So yeah. we should have at least about 16. We almost got our limit, I think. We're going to have to count them real quick. What's there? Three, gloves, five. Man. Here, you want to count them? I got gloves. Man. All right, there's five on the deck. Five. Six, Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen. Sixteen, we're allowed two more. Let's go. Let's go. Right we gotta try to get our limit. Right here, we'll get two real quick. <laughs> two more before dark, baby. Let's go. <laughs> Heck yeah. You sure that one's a keeper? You want to double check? The one I just threw in? Yeah. yeah. Okay. Which one's the hem? This one here. Double check them up. All right, we're gonna try to get two more. We did grab that quick knife. You see that bag in here? Yeah. You talking about your bag? Yeah, that's what we had. I dumped them all out of your bag. Oh. Oh. 
across the boat, found the bag, got pulled. Oh, it's in a run. Not bad, huh? Not bad. It's been an interesting day, I'll tell you that. We lost our dive bag at the first spot because the anchor drug, and we just rushed to the boat and we left our uh, lobster bag. We, where were you think? We caught one lobster and just swam to the boat with it, but after we got pulled over, we found our bag and we found a bunch more lobster. It's a good day. So we only have a few more minutes before the sun goes down on us. But we really wanted to get our last two lobsters that we were allowed. So we jump back in and I follow Randy quick and within about one minute he's seen a big lobster. <laughs> you got one? He got one too! He got one too! We're done! We got it! Woo! Yeah yeah! So we're only allowed a couple more lobster. We went and got them. We looked up and the boat was a mile away. No anchor. Well, uh, didn't you have a safety tie on it? I keep, no. <laughs> <laughs> uh, next time we'll put a safety tie. We had been talking about it. We had been talking about putting metal around it, you know, a safety or something, but yeah, we never did that. I just kept tightening it and tightening it every few days. And, uh, <sighs> Uh, Don't forget safety wire on the shackle. It yeah. might save your life. Actually, I probably got some in my truck. We had talked about it a few times, but Man, we were wore yeah, out. And uh, I'm always usually in deep water when I'm near the boat. I'm, I'm, I'm in, what a day! Uh, oh my God! This, uh, I got to speed up a little bit. I got another. They don't even all fit in a bucket. You got another bucket right here. This is why we live here. <laughs> Not a bad day after all. This is why we work so hard. So we can do this a couple times a year. Other than that, life is brutal down here. We're allowed 18 and we got all 18, 18 studs. We tried to find our anchor before we left, but with the sun down as low as it was, it was really hard to see. So now we have an excuse to go look for it tomorrow and hopefully catch a couple more lobster. Stay tuned to see that video.